a little paradise, like a little garden Eden. I'm Joanna, I'm from Germany, and I came to the Finca about a month ago. It's been crossing my path a couple of times, like people who recommended it to me. And I've also been looking for communities to live in, to live closer in nature and be more in touch with nature. Also sharing some, yeah, some of my practices, like sharing some yoga classes and yeah. My name is Grace and um, I'm here since 24 years. Really, this, this project is part of my life. This is my heart's project. We have common goals together that we all um, agree upon. And this is like to live in harmony with the nature and to um, yeah, to become, to say, more open, more mindful, more kind with each other and with the earth. So there is a lot to learn for each and every one, and this we want to share. There is a new way to come to us. This is with a little boat over the ocean. In the beginning, we thought, oh my God, no one will come anymore after the mountain fell on our only access road. But um, we found a solution, which is small and improvised and we realized it's actually a benefit. We are much more than before a real retreat place. So I'm partly guest, partly working here. So I'm kind of getting the best of both worlds in a way. There is several ways to be part of us. So you can just come and be a guest. It doesn't mean just, you're a guest and you enjoy one of these beautiful accommodations we have. And then if you add some work, then you become the work exchange guest. And this is a guest who's still using a guest room, but he's engaging more with the community. And in this case, there's sometimes the people also want to be more part of the community. And then we say, okay, that's a different story. Then you can be a volunteer. I feel people are looking for new ways to live. And this, what we do since 36 years, is something they want to get to learn, get to know. So volunteering is a really good way to um, do that. I would say for people who are looking for time in nature to connect more to themselves, to find some, yeah, some quietness from all the busyness outside and at the same time are interested in making interesting connections, connecting with like-minded, like-hearted people and yeah, just finding that, having that balance between being for yourself but also being in a community. Yeah, this rubber tree is just, um, it really represents for me, it really embodies for me what we do here. We are here for personal growth and this growing of this tree and also his, um, his beautiful energy of, of caring and nurturing. Yeah, it's, it, he's really the center of this place. This land is magical power and enhances growth. And this is our Call. We have to support that and enable that and um, invite people to, yeah, to receive it, to make the best out of it. 